today. It is quite a claim to be able to say you are the only headmaster who can drink the water which drains off your playground. Yes, the pupils at Rainy and Dowd School in Maherfeld have helped design Ireland's first environmentally friendly playground, which is not only flood proof, but can also purify rainwater before it enters the drainage system. Letitia's been to find out more. Here comes the rain again, falling on my head like a memory. Pupils from the Rainy and Dowd School tip a bin full of water onto the pioneering permeable paving system in their playground and it disappears like magic. Rainy and Dowd School is in the basin of Maharafelt and three roads descend here, so drainage has been a problem which is now being partly addressed by this new surface. This hydro pave system is a, a car park playground that we've installed very recently. A hydro pave is basically a big bath that has a tile surface and the tile surface has pores in it that the water runs through very quickly. The concept is as the water runs through any dirt um, is filtered out or bacteria act upon it and thereby cleansing the water as it flows from one end of the, the car park to the other. The playground can be used for sports activities even in the wettest weather. Permeable paving uh, became popular a number of years ago in that uh, it, it was a solution to two major problems that uh, were developing in urban areas. One was flooding and we've seen a lot of that recently and the second was pollution to rivers and water courses. So permeable paving basically eliminates those two threats. The playground is also used for a variety of experiments by pupils of all ages. We're involved in taking samples and sending them off to Queen's where they can be analysed for future research. But the study also goes right down to first year. As you can see behind me, the kids are taking uh, samples of water from the storm drains and they can take the temperature of that so that we can find out if the water's cooling as it goes down through the system or not. The man who helped develop the system for Tobermore was very excited about the scheme because of the nature of the area and the heavy rainfall levels in South Derry. You've got this school which is incredibly forward thinking in science and you've got a company nearby, Tobermore Concrete, who are the UK's leader in making these products. So they've got together and it's a great synergy between industry and academia and it's actually going to make a massive difference into the way we build all kinds of roads in the future. This is where Argentina comes in because next year is the major international conference when this information can be discussed.